Good day everyone. Welcome to ABC Goldland YouTube channel. Welcome. As we've all known, studying is not something everybody enjoys. Some people get frustrated while stu studying just for a few minutes. We even realize that sleeping while studying is not associated with night alone. It happens even during the day. We have to hear people say, I always fall asleep while I read. No matter the time, not the book. What can I do to not to fall asleep while reading? Some will say, I sleep for 8 hours every night. But still, I feel sleepy the moment I open my books. What can I do? Some will say, I like what I'm studying or reading. But after 15 minutes, it I feel sleepy. What can be the reason? And how can I cure this? If you fall in any of these categories, thank God you're here. I will tell you some of the things that we do that make us sleep while studying. I was also having problem with this, but I thank God now. If you can really stick with these things, you are good to go. The number one thing I will talk about here is mind. Your mind. Your mind is very important. It must be active while studying. Studying is a mind game. Whenever your mind is not there, you've lost the game already. So try as much as possible to be fully focused while studying. Engage yourself adequately so that your mind will not be drift off while studying. And I will advise you that whenever you realize that you no longer have interest in whatever you are reading, <laughs> it is signaling, signaling that hey. Your mind is not actively participating again. Try to make your mind participate very well so that you would not what, sleep while studying. Later in this video, I will tell, us, tell you some of the things you should know that will set your mind right while studying. Let's move to number two. Number two thing is understanding. You must understand the material you are handling. I, under this, I have two things that I, that, that I will tell you that you must do. Number one, you must understand the smallest unit we use, e.g. words and symbols. To tackle this, you must get a dictionary alongside while studying. You need to get a dictionary. You will need this to check of some terms and symbols you don't fully understand. And trust me, like a magic, you no longer fall asleep while studying. Number two under this is previous knowledge. You must have previous knowledge of some of the things you are you are learning. Lack of interest or unseriousness in time past can make some of the things that you would not like while studying. It can cause sleeping while studying. Consider an example. A person given 3x plus 4y squared and he was asked to solve this. He was given y equals to 2 and x equals to 3. They gave him all the parameters in here. But tell me, if he does not know 3 times 3 equals to 9, would he be able to solve it? These are some of the things you must know. Previous knowledge matters while you are studying. Build on what you are studying. You build it, you build on it, you build on it. But if you have no foundation, forget which is previous knowledge it will be very hard to understand and this can lead to sleeping while studying let me give you some other things you can do to avoid sleeping while studying before we finally call it today but before then this is abc go learn youtube channel to enjoy some of our videos some educational videos that we'll make and those that we've made already subscribe click the notification bell so that you will never miss our videos thank you you can also comment in the comments box below to tell us some of the things that you are facing that you will need to know the way out. Like now, this video was requested by someone just on one of our videos. So if you want uh, your, your also to, to be like this, you can just comment in the comments box below. We will make a video on it. Thank you. Let's continue. Number four thing that I would like you to know after I have mentioned three things under two points. Number four, avoid eating heavily. Many of us immediately sit to study after lunch, dinner, or breakfast. We forget that the process of digestion causes temperate shortage of blood and nutrients in the brain. 
this would cause lethargy that comes after consuming heavily which will lead to low brain retention and if you can't retain very well i tell you sleeping is coming i don't say you shouldn't eat but try to eat right don't eat too much and you will see that you will no longer sleep while studying number five well ventilated environment i don't say you should look for table fan that will be blowing breeze towards your eye or your face don't try that because that will make you sleep eventually try to make the house cool not, not just a part but all the parts of the room number six sit upright don't lie on bed to study study while you are on bed you are actually telling your brain that this is where i used to sleep i want to sleep that's why i'm studying here. yes that's what you are trying to tell the brain because the brain has already known that that's where you you, you do sleep so for you to now study on bed sound that thing no I, I don't say some people do not do it and they would read well without sleeping but understand yourself sit upright be active let your body be actively working while studying number seven do revision work if it's a place that you've been reading for maybe like 50, 45 minutes or one hour get out go to the board you can just write what the things that you've learned try to teach others teach others and with this you realize that you no longer sleep your body is actively working at intervals number eight subject this this is very important because you have to know the subjects you are going to combine i would advise you that you should study in the morning you study theory questions study theory subjects subjects that you know that they are very hard study them in the morning because whenever you just wake up your body is ready your brain is cool to bring in new stuffs so then anything you read you'll be able to understand them better just try them try it i think you should have known this thing before but if, if it is just just the first time of knowing it try to read in the morning try to read in the morning that will be difficult subjects so in the afternoon take a little bit simpler question or like the morning something that you know that it is a mixture of theory questions to objectives or something like that study that every time you will see that you will be able to get them very well and in the night in the night i repeat in the night don't study theory questions or theory subjects study subjects that are not hard that are easy in the night so that you would not fall asleep if you can follow these steps and do them adequately you never fall asleep again number nine read out loud the more you hear your voice the more the environment is less lethargy and with this you will not be able to sleep you will be active in that process the process of you opening your mouth and all that you will be active it's impossible for you to be talking and at the same time you are sleeping you are laughing it's impossible so let's move to the next which is 10 10 is what mark important point mark important point you can highlight words make flowcharts this would help you even to remember answers during exam even the main thing we came here to do which is to avoid sleeping will be accomplished because when your mind is actively participating in all what you are doing you would not be able to sleep at that particular time thank you 11 keep yourself hydrated drinking water or keeping yourself hydrated is very important it is not only good to avoid sleeping while studying but it's also good for studying itself you can check my channel for a video that i will make on water to tell you that water is very vital while studying if not subscribed subscribe now so that you will get more this water i will recommend the water should be somewhere at a distance to where you are seated if you are seated in your room make it make the water to be inside the refrigerator or in the kitchen so you have to stand up walk around before you get it don't let it be where you are seated b you would see that with this the body will be active periodically and with this you will be able to overcome sleeping while studying and don't drink drink it just once drink it periodically 
tip number 12 take a break take breaks in between avoid studying continuously take 10 to 15 minutes break in between in between maybe 45 to 60 minutes of your studying during this time you can you can take some easy exercise like stretching your arms and leg just to make yourself active at that particular time make sure it is at intervals you can also co combine drinking water that i said earlier with it it's your choice tip number 13 studying and working if you realize that all what i said earlier you've done it but you didn't get the result you wanted you can opt in for this stand and walk while reading this would help especially during the night after trying this method you will realize that your mind will be actively participating while studying so this will stop you from sleeping unnecessarily tip number 14 get a good sleep a sleep of five to six hours enough not something like seven to eight hours try to know what you are doing it's enough sleeping for eight hours is too bad after you slept like that your brain will be fresh you'll be ready to take in new things don't be some somebody that will be like no i'll not i will not sleep i'll not sleep i'll not sleep you're just stressing yourself and there's a reality you break down so don't try this sleep and read adequate sleep will help you not to be sleeping unnecessarily why reading tip number 15 make sure you check the closeness of the book to your eyes avoid keeping your eyes too close to your books while reading them tip number 16 take light food and fruit in between when you studied for some time during your break you can just take light food you can take fruits i, I really recommend fruits you can take fruits while studying. Let number 17. Avoid work out before settling for study. Most of us do work for some time before we settle down to study. No, 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 no. This is wrong. Let's try to make ourselves calm, our brain cool before we start studying. This will stop us from sleeping while studying. Let's move to tip number 18, which is music. Music. Music is a vital thing. It cannot be left out. Play cool music while studying, and with this, you will see that you will no longer be sleeping while studying your books. Under music, take note of this. Play cool music, not all music, but cool. Tip number 19 Keep your study place well lighted. It could be a room or somewhere else. Make sure the lights are on while reading. One of the mistakes we make is studying with a lamp that leaves a significant portion of a room dark. This promotes a cozy environment which easily drifts off our mind. And there we go, we sleep. So if you want to really ensure that you do not sleep again, make sure you use a lamp that will not leave the significant portion of your room dark. Now, not be only where you are that has light because you looking at a dark room at a dark portion of your room can make you to feel sleepy thank you tip number 20 take naps if you know you want to read at, at night you can take nap in the afternoon if you know you want to read maybe during the afternoon you can take nap maybe before then you can take nap so try to take a nap before you start studying you realize that after doing this you will be focused while studying the next the next uh, thing you have in, on your list you will be focused you you really work well because your brain is cool at that time and you will get many things well this will really stop you from sleeping while studying tip number 21 this is four in one it's a bonus though so consider subscribing these four tips are one avoid distraction try try not to be distracted if you are distracted you will not get things right and you might sleep time management also manage your time well if you can manage your time well you will see that 
even sleeping will not be part of your agenda because you've written, you've you already known what you want to study at that particular time. So, why will you tell me that you will sleep? No, you will not sleep because you have something that is driving you. You have a self drive that is driving you, which is that time management. You are, you are managing your time. So, that will be driving you to do it. Motivate yourself. This is another self drive on its own. Motivate yourself. If you, can, if you can't motivate, motivate yourself, Get motivational speakers. You can check other videos. You can check other things that can help you. You can get people that are doing well, that are better than you, that are like-minded people. That can that can really help you. So they will motivate you, and this will be a drive to read. Even when you feel sleepy somehow, sometimes it will be eh. Someone motivated me to do something like this. Ah, ah, no, no, no. I want I want to be the best, and I'll be like this. No, no, no. With that, you'll be motivated to read more. Good group studies. Could be also useful you can get friends maybe five or four that you know that they are they are really good they are like-minded people get them together read at the same time if someone is sleeping the other will wake the others will wake the person if someone is sleeping if you are sleeping you will wake they will wake you if they are sleeping also you you will wake them so with that you wake yourselves and things will go on smoothly with this you will achieve your targets and you will see that top that you want to be You'll be there. Have a self drive and reward yourself. You can try to reward yourself anytime you see that uh, you've gotten this this very thing you wanted. Try to reward yourself so that that would challenge you to do more. Thank you. So far, you've done something. You've enjoyed this video. But why haven't you subscribed? Subscribe now. Uh, subscribe y'all, yeah. subscribe, subscribe never to miss any of my videos, I wish you best, 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 don't forget to leave your comments on this very video, if you need anything that you would like me to make as a video, comment and I will do it, please, 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 I'm begging you, subscribe, thank you very much for enjoying this video, thank you very, very much. Have a nice day. One more thing, one more thing. I'm sorry. You can also share this video to some of your friends that you know they need it so that they will also be the best they want to be. Thank you very much. Bye.